Hey, greetings, Superinos. How you doing? Well, it occurred to me I haven't done a proper video in quite some time. So let's get to it, shall we? Mm-hmm. Dragon. Yep, that's right. Time to do another video. And hey, look what I got here. Three of them. Yeah. Leftover from Zombie Jeebus Day. So let's open them up, see what we get. Yeah. Dragon. Egg. Mm-hmm. You get the theme. <laughs> so we're going to do a little playing catch-up, I guess, also. It's been forever since I made a proper video. And uh, I've been watching a lot of stuff out there. A lot of good stuff. A lot of good topics. But uh, not a lot of energy to get back to doing videos. Working life. Drives you nuts. Chocolate eggs. I love these things. Easter. The only good thing about Easter to me is the candy. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Kind of a white chocolatey thing on the inside. Brown on the outside. A little mangling going on there, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Nothing wrong with that. Mmm. Awesome. A little pod inside. Let's see what we get. I'm sorry. Oh, didn't I give you some? Yeah, I bet you wish I could, huh? 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 Alrighty, let's see what's in the pod, man. Nifty little plastic pod with some kind of toy thing. Sometimes you get cool, nifty little toys. I bought a few of these and spread them around at work at Easter just for fun. Oh, check this out. Okay. Some kind of little car. Right on, right on. Okay. Okay, it's a car. I get the idea. I know what I know what to do with a toy car. I mean, I played with a million of them when I was a kid. Original Hot Wheels. Anybody remember those? Those are awesome. Okay, the basic idea here is here. It's called uh, Sprinty. It's called Sprinty. Isn't that special? Uh, and it looks kind of like... Oh, I get it. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I don't know if you can see that. There's kind of like a little, little tab on the back there. It looks like an airfoil. A little tab. And if you kind of... Apparently, if you hold your finger down on it, you kind of throw it. Oh, I get it. Okay. Let me try this. Hang on a second. I'll be dragging. I'll be down here. You can't see this, but trust me, I'm sure it's awesome somehow. Hang on. Yep, sure enough. <laughs> Thing's got a little uh, plastic tab, and you flick that, off it goes. Dragon. You get the idea. I mean, you know. Okay, that one's another egg. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's in this one. So there's been a lot of crazy things going on in the world. I try to pay attention. I really do. I watch some of your videos out there. A lot of good stuff. I watch some of the things going on in the world. Some really crazy, terrible things. So a hell of a lot of it, there's not much I can do a hell of a lot about. So I enjoy a little of this. I get out in the world. I hang with friends. I make the odd video and have some fun with my new camera. My GoPro camera. Not this one. Not that one. That's my crappy little life cam. Okay, we got another egg. Let's crack it open. Chocolate, look at that. Oh. Mm. Nom, nom, nom. That's part of the tradition. Apparently, you've got to say, nom, nom, nom. This is how it works. Dragon. Okay, let's see what's in this particular little egg. Dragon's egg. But yeah, like I said, I'll, let's play some catch-up. I haven't made a series 
video in a hell of a long time. There's some topics out there that I certainly, you know, had a lot of feeling about. And thought, I, you, know, you bastards, I gotta say something about that. And then, you know, I don't get around to it. Partly not from time, whatsoever. Warnings. Everyone's got this stupid little warning. They waste paper on the little one. Don't give it to your little kids. They'll strangle your dad. You know these things are illegal in the United States? <laughs> Crazy buggers. Okay, this is some kind of a... Uh, some kind of thing with a camel. Not like that, you sick buggers. Alright. See if we can't figure out how to put together a camel. Uh, Alright. It is apparently, uh, you take um, step one. Take uh, this piece. And... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Okay, it goes this way. Hold it this way. Yeah, short nub at the back, long nub at the front. And then I take the head. And apparently the head fits in here. Yeah. And like that. Like that. Hmm. Camel's head is in. There we go. Then you take, oh, okay, like two halves of the body freaking thing here. Like that's all it is. And then there it is. Okay. And I guess because he's that big, he wouldn't have fit in the pod. So you get a camel in three pieces. Give you something to put together, I guess. But it only goes together one way. Oh, they should have made the head bob or something. That would have been cool. Oh well, that one was pretty lame. Not as good as the car was. The car was like, you know, kind of cool. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Getting a little low on the dragon. Mini swill. Mini swill. Mini swill. Sir Walty. Those of you that know, you know. Okay, so hey, speaking of politics, <laughs> did you know that recently in Canada, in the province of Quebec, the separatist party known as the Parti Québécois, who were in power at the time, thought it would be a good idea to hold a snap election. In order to increase their power, you see they had a minority government. Figured that they could get themselves a majority government and new mandate from the people by playing on certain issues, one of which was being separation from Canada yet again. Yeah raising the specter of a referendum of separating the province of Quebec from Canada yet again. <sighs> I don't think most people had a taste for that. Yeah, no, no. And as a matter of fact, one of the additional issues that the Parti Québécois were pushing was a, uh, a little item known as the, uh, Charter of, uh, the Quebec Charter of Secular Values. Uh, and the idea behind this being that uh, public officials would no longer be allowed to wear uh, obvious symbols of religious belief while holding office, uh, you know, and while at work, etc. Anything apparently, uh, you know, uh, uh, a kirpan, a, a, a hajib, or anything based on any kind of religion like that, uh, large crucifixes, apparently average or small crucifixes are going to be given an exception, or at least that was the idea. Not sure quite why, um, but anything like that. Uh, an obvious display of religious belief would not be allowed to be worn by public officials and government servants of any kind in the performance of their duties. Uh, it seems a lot of people weren't quite ready for that step yet. Um, I can understand the intent. Perhaps it was a little soon for most people, especially given that a lot of people in Quebec are Roman Catholic. <laughs> yeah, so it wasn't going to go over well, that idea, to some extent, with some people. Um, that they couldn't wear their religious symbols, uh, etc. So, uh, yeah, uh, after proposing these ideas, uh, the Quebec party was soundly defeated and gone. Gone. Separatist party, you're gone. Yeah, you lose. You're out of here. <laughs> that was a silly walk, politician. A silly walk to cause to call an election at that time. People don't want that shit. No, they don't. Drat. The hell it's empty. How'd that happen? Well, look, here's his twin. 
All right, let's try this one. There we go. I know we can do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, and look, what do you know? We've got another egg. Let's open it up, see what we get in this one. Hopefully this one doesn't suck. The car was pretty cool. That's kind of fun. Another egg, another egg, another egg. More chocolate. How do I tell this piece? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to mail while I open this egg. I'm going to turn around a piece. Dragon. Oh, that's good. Wash it down with. Oh, that one opened funny. Funny lag. Maybe it would be something cool. So inside this one, we'll see what we got. Okay. Alright. Mm, yeah, okay. This is some kind of um, thing. <laughs> get it out of there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We're going to look at that one. We're going to look down. We're going to see what we get here. Piece of paperwork. This one here appears to be. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Like a little uh, spyglass, mini magnifying glass kind of thing, apparently. A little, uh. Oh, right here. How does this work? How do we open this? The hell? Now you would think that. I think dragons are kicking in because I can't even figure this damn thing out. Give it to a three year old, have it open in three seconds. Click. Oh, okay. You hold the thing, and you the thing, and it's got the thing, and you push the click. Click. Ah oh, ha ha ha! Isn't that cute? It's a switchblade magnifier. Ah, oh, get the little hoodlums ready. <laughs> Wait a second. Holy shit! It actually, kind of works. Wait a second. Wait a Okay, so you know, after you've had enough of those dragons, that's kind of how things look. <laughs> Anywho, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. That's kind of like... Oh, yeah. Hardcore. <laughs> that's the coolest one of all. And look, it's got like a little, little friggin' belt clip and stuff. Well, other than that, what else is there to catch up on? Let's see. No, I don't know. Chocolate. That's good stuff. Yes, it is. Dragon. Well, let's see. What else is there to catch up on? The weather is finally broken here in Manitoba, Canada. Spring has sort of kind of arrived. We're supposed to get some rain showers and snow flurries the next few days, but it should be nice enough, sunny enough to get out and uh, goof around with my new camera. I have that GoPro Hero 3 Black that I'm really quite enjoying. A uh, pretty nifty bit of kit. Uh, and it occurs to me that maybe in the next uh, little while I'll start getting a few more videos done with that. As well as uh, I have a couple other thing, interesting things, some new technology I'm playing with that I'll have to, uh, I'll have to show you all guys. Maybe I'll do a video of some of the new kit I'm playing with, including a, a portable audio recorder and as well as for doing audio stuff, some uh, MIDI stuff that I've gotten into. So uh, we'll see what happens with that. Well, that's it for ketchup. Hope you enjoyed uh, today's Dragon's Eggs with ketchup. See you later. Peace. Have a long night, y'all.